And I've created a monster. Cause nobody wants to see Diego no more. They want Marjo. I'm chopped liver. Well, if you want Marjo, this is what I give you. Grand Space Adventure with the White Bomber. I was passed away. Let's go save the day. Planet by planet jumping as we go to find a way to beat all the monsters that are here and best in the very field where I am blasting. Wait this long, I stop complaining. I'm back streaming live. It's time for playing. See, wait, you need some help? It's a million, so. Oh crap, I fell off. <laughs> And this quest for four, this is quite appealing. So the big old thing they can make me sink. But they best rethink what I get on the rink. Came up with this grand plan. Came up with this grand plan, you see. But it looks like they didn't count on me. So I'm right in place, up in your face. Here I go, head in the race, give me the chase and get ready. Countdown, ten to zero, it's time for I play with my man hero. So I got some time to beat, so everybody watch me be leap. Run through the lungs with me, so slick this far play with my jokes on it. <laughs> oh god, I can't believe I did that. Anyway, yep. And... And I keep messing up that jump. Okay. So anyway. This roller coaster is going all over the place. Where the hell am I anyway? I can't even tell. <laughs> Population. Welcome to Sandtown. Population Sand. At least I didn't quick sand. That would be annoying. That would be so freaking annoying. This is probably one of the more annoying levels of Bomberman Hero. It's all about this freaking coaster. But you do get the, uh, a new power up here. So you just gotta wait for me to. It's Pac Man again. It's Mr. Flying Pac Man. Take this! Nailed it. Alright, anyway. It's gonna be a very long ride, folks. Ah, here we go. Here's a new power-up. So anyway... Jump! Oh. Take it! Whoa! As you can see, my throwing power has now become... Super far! Boom! 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 Whoa, I can't believe I missed that. There we go. Anyway, as you can see, we gotta collect those freaking critiques. But, hold on. Um... I get the feeling I missed something. So, jump! Running, 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 running. And get on this thing. Woohoo! Anyway, I guess I'll just take this. Doesn't look like I missed anything. Then I better jump over here. It's gonna suck if the draw distance was just um, toying with me here. No, it doesn't seem like it is. Oh, no, wait, shit. It did. It did. Gotta go back now. Jump over here. Oh, look, the coaster's already here. That was quick. Yeah. <laughs> That's actually another thing that's been uh, coming out recently. The whole thing with two whole things with Nintendo that's, I guess you could say, big deals right now. One of the things that apparently people are hit, getting big issue with what um, the uh, president of America was was saying with regards to the launch titles for PS4 and Xbox One. Because apparently he just said, "Man, oh crap, I hurt myself." He says met to the launch titles for PS4 and Xbox One. And pretty much defends that what Nintendo's been trying to do with their product is basically focus so much on the uh, experience that you get when you play the games rather than the tech. Which is kind of why I respect Nintendo in a sense. I mean, some, there, there are people who are going to be yeah, iffy on on the launch titles that Nintendo, or any of the titles that Nintendo has recently. But I've always been kind of back in it. Never. And it's not necessarily that I'm a Nintendo fanboy or anything like that. I just like, I just happen to like Nintendo a little more than other consoles. I like Sony. I, I like the PlayStation series. I, th I think that's a great console. But, 
I've always been more on, on the Nintendo side because they always do things that are a little different. I, I, and I like how they do it. The, the little difference is... It just makes it, their stuff a little more awesome. That's my two cents on it. Uh, the other thing that's been coming up with Nintendo is the release of the Nintendo 2DS. Now, it's already been having mixed reactions. Some people are okay with it, and some people like me just get blasted in the face. <laughs> anyway, um, wait, hold on, let me see if I can get this. Nope, dud. But yeah, um, where was I? Uh, oh yes, the Nintendo 2DS. Was the 2DS? Oh, oh whoa. <laughs> I got the higher animation. This way. Nope. Ah, mother. Okay, I'm good. So yeah, regards to the Nintendo 2DS, I think it's a great idea on Nintendo's part to release a version of the 3DS without, you know, the 3D implemented. That's a great way to drop the price point, especially for people who absolutely don't want or cannot have a 3D incorporated. Oh crap! Cannot uh, take up the uh, on the 3D. So it's pretty smart on their part to. Release a version that completely nixes the use of, uh... Great on them for uh, remo removing the uh, 2D factor. But, I still think that, um, it, the fact that they went without the uh, clamshell design that they've been using for ever since the uh, Game Boy Advance SP, uh, the coaster just came. Yeah, since... Without going to that clamshell design, it just looks too bulky for, for a handheld uh, game system. In my, that's just my opinion on it. Though. I really don't like um, th that that direction that they took. Now, granted, this is meant to be for younger players, where basically, I guess you could say they're thinking, "Oh, you know, these little kids, are, when they get their first console, they're just gonna snap the clamshell, the top shell, the top screen off its hinges, or something like that." So I can understand where Nintendo was going with that, but personally, it, it wouldn't. Even with the uh... hold on, wait, don't touch that. Hit him! Yeah, yeah. Now hit that guy. I'm the greatest. Uh... All right, so yeah. All in all, I do. I think um, Nintendo will will do well with the Nintendo 2DS, getting a um, a new look. I cannot speak today. The um, I think they'll do well getting younger players with the um, 2DS, especially because parents are gonna love how it's a drop price. But um, if I were to get a handheld, I definitely would go with the 3DS just for its um, better portability. Speaking of price drops, the fact that the Wii U has dropped price actually makes me kind of happy because I haven't been able to get... Oh, I missed a crystal. Um, the fact that I haven't been able to get it yet makes me a bit sad. Well, not that it makes me sad, but you know, it, um, it's something that I've been want something that I wanted to get that I wasn't able to due to money issues, to say the least. But, now that they dropped the price, it actually makes it like... It was worth waiting. So, my patience might uh, pay off a bit more than I expected it to. Because now I don't I get to pay $50 less by the time I get to uh, buy a Wii U. Happy, happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy, joy. That's all I need to say. Going down. Take this, buddy. That too. This and that. Whoa! Come on, man. Take the bomb like a man. I don't care if you're a robot, you've got to take it like a man. That's all that needs to be said. Anyway, what do we have here? Another key crystal. Is that, um... Oh, that's all of them, so I can exit the level. But, as you notice, there was an Adark Bomb in this level. So let's go get the Adark Bomb. And this little heart. Because hearts are always helpful. Always. Always. Come on! And jump into this orange one! Whee! Thank you. Chip. Um, I think that's everything that I needed. 
probably I'm I probably that, 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 that. probably would be off by 50 if anything. But we'll see. Time tested! Fuck, I was off 200. I did it! Oh well, I'll take care of that um later. Dark Maid's time! So this is also gonna be the introduction to a brand new power-up as well. Uh, you can see it in the background there. It's a gray bomb. Or a white bomb. I mean, shh, don't fuck. I'm gonna save that um, bomb up power up for a reason. You'll see later. Collect that. Jump over here. Barrel! Oh, it snapped. All I can say is if PewDiePie played this um, game, he probably would not be too keen on the choice of enemies. That's all I need to say about the subject. Moving on. Going down. Slowly, slowly, slowly. And there's a slug. Nope. Nope. I cannot fight slugs with fire. I'm not kidding. I can't. Slugs are impervious to fire. But slugs are not impervious to salt. Which is what these white bombs are. Salt. We now have salt bombs. Perfect way to spice up your your meals. Just throw a bomb into into the slug and watch it sizzle. Yeah. yeah. But, well, unfortunately, salt bombs are not able to open up boxes or defeat enemies that uh, would otherwise require normal bombs. So that's why I'm saving up that um, bomb power. Maybe I have to uh, go up here now. So let's see. Yep. No! Don't grab that little thing just yet. You never know. You never know. Oh, look, an Adark bomb. Wait for spikes. I wonder if I can make that jump. Okay, yeah, it would help if I hit the jump button in time. Ugh. I also noticed that there was a slug bomb. No, the walls in the way. I can't. Oh no! 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 <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Stupid knockback! I'm down to no one life. Damn it. Anyway. Here we go. We jump here. And destroy you. Destroy you too. Ah, hit him. All right, I'm gonna go this way first. See if I, if there is a way to make that jump. Right. Okay, but I'm gonna need to make this jump and shoot! Little son of a gun. I just need to make sure that I kill all those slugs first. Then I can uh, safely remove the salt bomb. Safely remove the salt bomb. I don't know. Uh, okay, so anyway, let's take this slowly and not fuck up again. I already did the hard part. I did most of the hard parts. I think that's the last slug. I might be wrong. Any sudden movements. Any at all. Oh look, I was wrong. There is another slug. Here, take it. Oh, the, no! Here. <laughs> really? Okay, um, how do I direction this? How do I do direction? Oh, good, it reached Thank God. Alright. Easy. Easy guess. Alright, I think that's all the uh, slugs. So let's carefully move.
And now I can blow up these boxes. Open up! Yay, big gem! Was there anything else over here? I can't remember. Yeah, there was. This thing right here, which is a heart! Thank you for the heart. box. Not the Nerf Ball! Okay. My audience is really quiet right now. Anyway, I three the and I think the only thing left is that bomb power up, which means I'm done. Let me go this way. I'm gonna go ahead and exit the level now. Good thing the egg getting to the eggs is pretty easy. Yum. Why the hell did that not work? I have no idea. Yum. And into the ending. Thank you and good night. <laughs> I did it. Next level. The Mad Coaster. Okay, so we jump on this thing. And we pretty much have another long ride. But at least on this ride, we're being shot at. Wait, that's not a good thing. Go away. I missed. You missed me. You missed me. Really, man? Point blank and you can't hit a... And you can't hit a white guy? But, but what? <laughs> that that came out wrong. My bad, folks. Uh, please ignore the accidental rate. Ow! Wait. Okay, I deserve that. But you deserve that one too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yes. Goo. And I jump onto this platform. Don't fall off. No! The game's over. Well, that's a game over. That is how you hit stuff. Don't touch me. I, I hit, I, don't kill me, I kill you. Uh. Okay, that person didn't agree. You can die, because you caused my death last time. It wasn't me accidentally falling to my doom, it was all your fault. I'm sticking to that story. I'm gonna go this way. Actually, no, wait, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, no. I'll go this way. Yeah, no slugs! Okay. Okay, you very- No! <laughs> Panic. Alright, okay, we're good. We got that gem. We got the orange chaos emerald for the upteenth time. Slug, what the hell are you doing to the wall? <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> what the hell? Uh, whoa, okay, no, we don't want to grab that yet because we know we have salt bombs in this level. Uh, where are the salt bombs? Ooh, before we get the salt bomb, let's go ahead and grab this thing right over here. Because obviously we needed that box. <laughs> we have not seen things hump walls that, that well ever since Super Mario 64 Mario Sonic's rerun. Remember everybody? The penguin! S slug. That's not very nice. Go home and think about it before I salt you later. Think about what you did before you get salt. That's, that's one way to put it, I guess. Okay, so I guess the salt bombs are this way. And then this way. Careful. Don't fall. Fall, don't fall, no, don't fall, don't fall. I freaking know what they wore this way. I kick the bomb. You take the salt. That's how it works in this place. Anyway, let's keep moving. I think there's one more on this side. Ah, uh, yes, there is one more on this side. 
You haven't learned your lesson, haven't you? You disappoint me, Slug. Slugs don't learn their lessons, ladies and gentlemen, as you can now notice. How disappointing. If you wanted a pet slug, be, be aware. They're not obedient. In the slightest. Speaking of shit, I am about to die. Again. This this planet does not like me. I, it's like the one I've got... I, oh, whoa, whoa. Salt will still hurt me, okay? So... Let's, let's not do anything crazy. Okay, really? Are you gonna hide behind the wall? Are you gonna make me come around for you? Son of a bitch. There. You happy? I went around. Damn you. Damn you all to hell. Anyway, I can't. I don't want the salt bombs anymore. So, take a bomb, and now I have normal bombs. Okay, see? Let's not do anything stupid. Something tells me something stupid's gonna happen because I said that. Damn. Damn it. Damn it all. Damn. Count how many times I say damn. Damn, 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 Cute. No! Uh, ah! <laughs> God damn! <laughs> no! Oh well. It happens. Anyway. Boom, shaka, boom. Thank you, Zion. Th thank you so much for that. That's. Very encouraging. Alright, let's get it up against... Anyway, as you can see, I'm moving these big-ass stones to push them into the wall here. Uh, for Pybot to tell us. Ah, there's another guy right there. Hey, buddy, over here. Psych! Me! Anyway, let's push this a little closer so that I can uh, actually grab that heart because I need it. Come on. Jump! Okay, running start. Jump! Grab it! <laughs> That's how you do it. <clears throat> anyway, let's keep pushing this in. Push it in, push it in. And uh, anyway, let's go ahead and grab a rainbow. So anyway, let's grab this crystal. You're probably wondering, what's this orange thing for? You probably also notice that this is the whole level. Um, yeah, this is pretty much the whole level, and you're wondering now, wait, where's the exit? Well, that's kind of why we're pushing all these blocks for. I think that's all the points. So anyway, this is the final box that I need to push. A warp beam! You guys probably remember that uh, little warp beam thing as the sort of thing that um, Nitros uses all the time. Going up! Da -da 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 -da. Bah. I did it! So, yeah, we're about to enter the fine. the boss of this area. It is a fucking sphinx with cannons. Hell yeah! Then the princess is just lying on the floor there. Nothing seductive going on here, folks. 
What? Bomberman? Here? Is he- are you blind? I'm right- right in fucking front of you! Dude! Do you want to suffer that robot's fate? Well damn, you made him harder! So yeah. Paimon has been turned to stone by Bobbin's magic. So he has the magic to make things hard? Is that what you're saying? Maybe that's why you're lying on the floor so seductively, hand lady? <laughs> yeah, I just went there. Anyway, looks like we're being teleported to a different location for this fight. I'm okay with that. But wait, where, how about, where does this guy go? Damn, that is a huge warp beam. That thing must be heavy. So that's quite a powerful beam, ladies and gents. A very oh, you see, she's sad now that the, that his hard magic is no longer with her. But no, no, lion, stay away from me. Ooh, that that did a little damage. Don't don't touch me. Oh, what's this? Oh, now you're gonna shield your face. Then I'm gonna hit you in the tail. The tail. The tail. There we go. Oh, you want to turn around and shoot this little those little cannonballs at me? Cannonballs to the face. The tail. <laughs> oh, I missed. Oh crap! Oh crap! Nope. No fire for me, please. That's very true. Sphinxes are always cool. I guess that's why they picked it as a, a boss concept. Oh, yep, right there. Right in the keister. And now he's dropping blocks from the sky. What the heck? That's not fair. By the way, he does, um, he, if you're too close to him, he does have an attack where he'll pretty much... Ow, my face. Whoa, oh, fuck me. Yeah. Right in the... Ah, oh, there it is. If you touch that, he turns you to stone temporarily. Hey, do, the, do that thing again. Yeah, thank you. Let's see if we can... It's, it's really hard to hit him uh, when he does that. Uh. Okay. Ah, okay, no. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't care if I get a low score. Just let me finish the level. <laughs> the fuck? <clears throat> I got this, folks. Don't worry. I got this. Blinding him with my bombs. It's easiest to hit him in the tail. Come on, hit him in the tail! Hit him in the tail! There we go. The good thing about this boss, he also flinches whenever he gets attacked. Not like the others. He also doesn't have that invincible laugh sort of thing. Okay, no. Buddy. Buddy! Come on, Balbin. Can, can't we agree to play a little fair? Just... Enough's enough. Why all this fighting, man? I bet you want to just go to sleep. Have a little cat nap. Do we really need to go through all this? I'm just gonna kill you. Man, how many hits do you take? Lost count. Oh no, I'm stoned. Come on, I'm afraid already. Dang, that was close. Oh, there we go. Yep, that went so well, ladies and gents. Great. The robot's back. Yay. I like you better as a stone, actually, to be honest. Well, at least we get to look at um, his happy face. I like Bomberman's happy face. You guys should know that by now. And, and of course, Nitros. 
took her to the premise, to not premise, to uh, Maze of Star, the next planet. No surprise there, ladies and gents. Let's fly away. I saw have silver, right? Yeah, that's all silver. I'll be sure to perfect that later on, guys. Not that it really matters. It's not like you guys are really gonna. Oh boy! Yeah, yeah, that's fun. That is a lot of fun. Oh wait, I fell. Oh well. Uh, thank you all for watching. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Follow on Twitter if you want to see future live plays. And hopefully we won't have so much fail next time. As we enter the snowy, half-looking planet. Bye, guys!